Hi everybody, happy Saturday. How are we doing today? Today is a fun day, it's family adventure day, so please make sure you don't spend all day cleaning. That's not any fun, and that's certainly not an adventure. My hair is falling. Oh. Just part of it. There we go. Okay. <laughs> so, let's start. Here we go. You want to start the day off, before you do anything, dress to shoes. Okay? Make sure you're dressed to your best. That is going to be different for everybody. Just make sure that you're comfortable in what you're wearing. If the t-shirt's too tight, you don't like the fabric, you don't like the design, you're going to be uncomfortable all day long. The only time that this does not apply is if you have to wear a uniform for work. And in which case, you're getting paid to be uncomfortable. So, suck it up and deal with it. Remember, don't forget, if you need to pause this video as we go through and get stuff done if it's not done already this morning or this afternoon or the evening i will put the timestamps in the description below so that way come noon or come evening you can just go straight to it your core six is next remember we've changed it to validate it a little bit more get your meals drink your water take your meds You've got self-work, so anything to work on yourself, anything that feeds your soul. Body work for a little bit. Maybe you're walking. Maybe you're going for a bike ride. Maybe you're doing yoga, whatever. Um, and then get a good night's sleep. Yes, honey? Um, guys, I just want to warn you. If you go for a bike ride, do not go too far. Yes. Because all the kids will be running around and you will fall down. Keep in mind, like we didn't do yesterday, um... That you have to ride back. <laughs> we forgot about that. I forgot about that. So do I. I also forgot about that too. <laughs> and, and that if you're going downhill one way, that means you're going uphill the other way. So keep that in mind. <sighs> All right. Next up, we have your intention. This is your mental direction for the day. There are so many different words you can use for what you consider to be your mental direction that you want to head. With it being Saturday, maybe adventure, family, fun, togetherness, anything like that. That's how you're going to approach each situation that you come to. Next up, we have only one card, not two. We have your three SMART goals. So, they need to be small, measurable, accurate, appropriate, reasonable, and timely. In other words, don't decide to clean the entire and reorganize the entire living room. Do it in stages. Okay? Otherwise, you're going to wear yourself out. And that's not fun. So, don't do that. What's on your calendar for today? <clears throat> do you have any work? Do you have any housework? Do you have any appointments? Do you have any events? Or is it just an adventure today? I really hope it's just an adventure. I know some days we have to do things like, I mean, in our home, uh, Sunday starts the work week. So it just is what it is. But I really hope you guys can take some time as a family and have some fun. Kids Day is next, broken up into five different areas. Their housework, so that would be chores, tasks. Um, their personal work, that would be brush teeth, wash face, eat their meals, drink their water. Their brain work, anything to grow their brain, let them pick. Or if they're not up for picking, you pick. We're doing flashcards and reading just for fun. I just want to play Minecraft. I know. Self-work. This is their pamper. That would be him playing Minecraft. 
So that's his fun. That's his self work. And then a body work, of course, is their movement. What do they want to do for exercise? He was actually playing outside for quite a while before. So he enjoyed playing outside and he got his body working. Trying to cut the grass with the toy combine blade. He was trying to cut the grass with the toy combine blade. All right. What are your meals for the day? Since today is Tuesday and we're looking at Saturday, I have no freaking clue. Hey, None. Watch the language. Yes. Um, I'm going to guess Juan is going to grow. I don't know. Please do. Um, I would really like to have biscuits and gravy one of these days, so hopefully I can get that. Did Juan tell me she's also cold? All right. It is now time for cleaning. So if any one of these things are not done, pause the video, go do them. Make your bed because it's easy. Remember, we're not looking for hospital corners. We're not looking for everything to be straight, perfect, bounce a quarter. We're looking for you to be able to look at it and go, yeah, that's made and go on with your day. Swish and swipe is next. Don't overcomplicate this. Okay? It should take you under two minutes. Walk into the bathroom. Swish out the toilet. Remember, this is not cleaning the bathroom. This is swish and swipe. Swish out the toilet. Grab a piece of toilet paper. Get it damp. Get the spots Three off the mirror. Paper. Two papers, two values. <laughs> Get the spots off the windows. Get this, or the mirrors. Get the spots off the sink and the counters. Don't move and organize anything on the counters. There is time for that later. Then you want to make sure that you get the rim of the toilet. You throw the toilet paper in the toilet. You flush and away you go. No extra laundry. Speaking of laundry, you've got your laundry circle. Wherever you start the day, make sure that's where you finish the day. So if you start the day at sort, then you go wash, dry, fold, put away. You end at sort. Wherever you start, maybe you're starting at dry, go all the way around. Maybe you're starting at fold, go all the way around. Doesn't matter. Complete your circle. That is actually our habit of the month. Pick up, put away is next. Focus on things that are going to make the morning easier. Maybe today being Saturday, getting ready for the kids to start back up at school. Maybe they need to do a little bit in their rooms. I personally love to break it up throughout the week because I don't want to have to clean the whole house on one day. I don't expect him to do it either. So. Don't spend all day doing a pickup put away though. Two minutes, five minutes, no more than 15. Have fun with it, set a timer. Who can pick up the most stuff in the least amount of time? <laughs> Don't forget your meal prep for today. This is doing anything that you can to make sure that meals go even smoother for you. That way maybe you can just dump and go. I mean, those are great, especially if you're having like a Chinese meal. That's really a good idea. Okay, wash and wipe the kitchen. You're washing the dishes from the morning. You're putting the dishes away. You're wiping down the counters, wiping down the appliances, whatever it is. Take care of it. A clean kitchen is a happy kitchen and a productive kitchen. So... Time for noon time, 9.15. I'm being consistent here. All right. Time to self-assess the day so far. Noon time, self-assess. Facts only, please. Your opinions don't matter here because our opinions can be misleading and our feelings change moment to moment. So facts only. Are you where you want to be? Are you where in the direction that you wanted to head? If not, start making some changes. If you are, congratulations, great job. Pick up, put away. Or, 
Papa, make sure that you are focusing on things right now that will help improve your af improve your afternoon. If you are not going to be home, I guess you don't really need to worry about it, do you? Make sure you get that adventure in with your family. It can be watching a movie. It could be going outside and going for a walk. It can be playing a game. It could be anything. Just have some good quality family adventure time. All right. We're at our laundry circle. Keep it going. You should be making your way through today just like any other day. Keep this circle moving. Remember, a circle has no starting point, has no ending point. So in order for this circle to be complete, you must complete it all the way around. So there's your reminder. A circle is infinite. Time to wash and wipe the kitchen down from lunch. Yes, we got to do it again. Remember, a clean kitchen is a happy and productive kitchen. So we want to make sure that we are washing and wiping. Wash the dishes, wipe the counters off, wipe the dishes off however you want to do it. Just make sure the kitchen is done and ready for you for this evening. <coughs> Dirt cleaning, there are no missions for today. Have fun. Maybe you're doing some missions from the week or whatever, but have fun with them, okay? No dirt cleaning assigned. It is time for the evening. We're looking at uh, 12, okay, 15 seconds off. All right, so uh, where are we? Where are we? There we go. Assess the day once again. Facts only. Opinions will not help you. Feelings will not help you. Look at the facts. Did you have an enjoyable day with your family? Did you get done what you wanted to? If you didn't, are you okay with it? Did you accomplish your goals? If you did, great. If not, there's always tomorrow. So, facts only. Time to check the calendar and the forecast for tomorrow. I'm going to take the forecast first before we go for a walk, walk or a bike ride. Yeah, just like and I have gotten caught in the rain going for a walk and a bike ride the last two days. It's not been, uh, actually, I can't say it hasn't been fun. It's actually been quite fun. Uh, Saturday, 82 and a 40% chance of rain. Okay, well. Let's go um, walking in there. Right? So, well, it looks like we're going to be heading into a lot of rain next week. Wonderful. All right, so that means it's going to be a warmer day. I need to make sure that dinner matches that. I'm not going to be wanting to be standing over the stove, hence the reason why I hope that wine will grow. There we go. Come on. There we go. Set up your launch pad. Launch pad for Sundays may even look a little bit different, but that's okay. I always have to make sure my computer is charged, phone is charged, nook is charged. And everything is together where I want it. Lunch is also then made. And of course, don't forget to lay out your clothes. I will not be wearing a sweatshirt and long pants like I have been most of this week. It is time for your final pick up put away of the day. Make sure that this one you hit the impact areas that will affect the way you react to things come tomorrow morning. If you wake up and you see yesterday's mess in the morning you're not going to be happy so get it taken care of laundry circle is still a spinning make sure you complete that one full rotation today you will thank yourself because man laundry can take a lot out of you when you got like three or four loads to go time to eat dinner and make lunches 
for those of you who have to work on Sunday, I have to make lunches today on Saturday. So that way he has something to eat. So stop, make dinner, and make lunches before you do the next thing because there's no point in cleaning up the kitchen if you then need to make dinner or lunches. Last wash and wipe of the day. So this is the way you're going to leave your kitchen for you tomorrow morning. Make sure it is what you want to see. So if you want to see a bunch of dishes and give yourself a task right away in the morning on top of everything else you need to do, by all means, do it. I prefer not. Lastly, get ready for bed as soon as you leave the kitchen from getting your final kitchen wash and wipe done. Because this way, number one, you will stop yourself from snacking. Number two, if you get tired, you can just go to bed. Number three, your day is done. You might as well relax. So, <coughs> that is your Saturday. I hope... Drink! Yeah. I hope you had a great Saturday. I will see you live tomorrow morning. Don't forget to leave me a comment. Let me know what you liked, what you didn't like, what you would like to see, what would help you. And I will be sure to add it. Also, don't forget to like the video, subscribe, and click the bell. Oh, and don't forget to share the video with other people. See, he, he's... He's my man that, that helps. He's my promotions agent. So, you all have yourself a great day, and I will talk to you Sunday morning. Bye!